Artful Art is a four-day art fair that's hosted at luxury waterfront homes on the Intracoastal, and people get there by water taxi, uh, and the boarding location is over at Bahia Mar Yachting Center. I wanted to create something that was different and something that couldn't necessarily be duplicated in other cities, and I wanted to be able to highlight all the wonderful assets that we have here in the city. And as you know, we're, we're called like the Venice of Americas, so obviously the Intracoastal Waterways is a really unique aspect of that and obviously the luxury waterfront homes on the Intracoastal are, are also part of that. So having these vacant properties that are also for sale gives me the opportunity to have like a really great kind of backdrop for all this wonderful art. The Society of National Geographic is a non-profit organization. It's probably one of the largest in the world. We have David Dublay, which is on display here today, which he works with nothing but the oceans and the conservatories. Now we're starting these galleries. I mean, we've only started them over two years, but it's another way for us to give awareness to throughout the world. And we like to do it through photography. We like to do it because there's always a picture and a thought and a story behind it. And that's what we're trying to do. Awareness and preserve. my first time at Art Fort Lauderdale. It's amazing so far. I love the water taxi and get to go and see all the beautiful homes. It sounds very fun. Most of the shows are either in galleries or in public spaces or in art fairs. That has been where I have shown. Uh, this is different because it's in a home. And so people are coming to see the home and to see the arch. It's a combination of both. I actually began to do a lot of painting living in New Mexico. And the quality of the light there was so bright and yet the landscape was so dull, I felt the need for color. And then moving here, I moved to be closer to my sister who lived here and being collaborative, it made more sense for us both to be here. Um, the light here is equal in, in vibrance, but there's so much color here that I think things have gotten even more colorful. <laughs> I was lucky because, you know, as one of the galleries, we have art in, in two homes, and I'm happy to have the two homes. The other one is the Southeast Second Court home, and this one, which is the San Marco home, and they're, both homes are very different in style. One is, you know, contemporary and very modern, which is this one. Uh, the other home is, it's, it's a Tommy Bahama home. I mean, beautiful, gorgeous home, you know, wood flooring, beautiful wood railings. So it's, a, it's great that we've had the two homes to be able to showcase you know, such a wide range of artists from all genres. This is an after party for Artful Ardell in conjunction with Lux and Cheers and Design. The audience is made up of the artists, sponsors, partners, kind of a lot of the people that were involved in pretty much the whole makeup of the show and really supported and helped make it happen. There's a lot of energy happening here tonight. We have Bedside, which is an amazing DJ, five-piece live band group. We also have a bunch of performance arts happening throughout the night. Right now we're in the living room, and so I'm painting live. And uh, anyone who's here has a heart for the arts, and so just to be a part of it is uh, like a huge blessing and, and really, really uh, a humbling experience. Our house is such a perfect canvas for art. My husband and I love art, we collect, and we love seeing all these people come through our home and all these wonderful artists getting to showcase in our home. I love Fort Lauderdale, I love this show. It's gonna grow, it's gonna expand. Andrew Martineau is the director. He was actually my student in Miami 20 years ago. And look what he's produced. I'm so proud of him. He's doing such great things. Him and Evan Snow, they're just blowing it up. We're super excited and really pumped about the success of it. Uh, we've got a lot of great feedback from the artists and you know the visitors. So we really kind of like tried to create like an artistic performance like uh, experience here tonight and really kind of tried to have something that the people that came for Art Auto can really enjoy and continue throughout the night.